I am off to the hairdressers today and you should say goodbye to the blue now because it's going. I'm quite upset about it actually. I've really enjoyed having blue hair. I think it really brings the colour of my eyes out and yeah, it's been like a nice chapter of my life. But today I'm going for a revamp. I'm going to my favourite salon, which is the Samantha Cusick Salon in Notting Hill. She's incredible. She's like the best one of the best hairdressers I've ever had the pleasure of doing my hair. And we're going to do something a little bit different, I think, for summer. I need to pull up some um, pictures, but I'm going to take you along for the ride with me. Very exciting week this week. I'm going away to Barcelona on Saturday, so in two days. And I'm going to be vlogging like my preparation to go away. And then I'm going to be vlogging the little um, weekend as well. So I really hope you enjoy this vlog. Let's go get my hair did. I'm so sad. Made beautiful eye contact with a beautiful guy on the train with brushed legs and arms and everything. And then he got off and I couldn't find him on happen. I am home and I'm so hot. It feels like a tropical rainforest in London right now. Here is my hair. I don't think you can really see it in this light, but it's basically like holographic mermaid and I'm so happy with it. I'm gonna post some pictures here so you can see it properly, but I'm really, really happy. Sam did an amazing job and I can't quite get over how beautiful it is. In fact, when she showed me it, I was like, no, I don't want it to fade. I'm already worrying about it fading because it's so pretty. I got home about half an hour ago. I had like a five minute nap, had some toast, and now I'm on my way to the circus. I am going to give Echo her first bit of pear. I think she'll like it because it's quite sweet and she has a sweet tooth. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, she likes it. Oh, are you saving the rest for later? Hello everyone, it is Friday today. Sorry if I have any black in my teeth, I've just eaten some Oreos. <laughs> So today I am packing and getting ready and prepping for my holiday. I'm going um, to Barcelona tomorrow with a friend and I am so excited. I need to finish packing, I'll show you kind of some of the stuff I'm taking with me. I've got the worst hay fever ever, I'm proper like sniffing at the moment. If you've been reading my blog recently then you will have seen that I'm currently working with a brand called Home Medics and I'm kind of like on a journey and reviewing their Duo Salon which is the fastest IPL device on the market and it basically gives you salon standards at home. So I've been using it for eight weeks now, testing it to remove kind of body hair um, at home and I wanted to show you the results quickly before I use it again for the last time before I go on holiday. I've been using it once a fortnight um, on my legs, my armpits and my bikini line. I'm definitely not going to show you my bikini line um, but I thought I'd quickly show you my legs. So I haven't shaved in about three days. Normally by now by three days I would have definitely needed to shave like there will be quite a lot of hair but I wanted to show you quickly sorry I'm showing you my hairy legs so I don't know if you can see this but this is my legs and there is pretty much nothing there's like a couple of patches here that I need to go over um, and pay more attention to today but apart from that um my legs are pretty much hair free and that's after three days of not shaving same with this leg here i've just got a couple of patches that i need to focus on more today so i am going to go and shave my legs now before you use it you need to shave your legs so that there's no kind of hair in the way and so that the light can reach the follicles better so i'm going to do that now and then show you how i use it so yeah i'm really excited about the results so far and i'm looking forward to showing off my smooth legs in Barcelona this weekend with my bestie, so her medics are sending me and her there to kind of celebrate my results and show off my smooth legs. So I'm like really looking forward to this weekend. It'll be a really good time. And I'm obviously gonna bring you along for the ride with me. Out of the shower, 
in some like loungewear. I'm gonna quickly show you how to use this just in case you are wondering. So it plugs into the mains which is good because it never runs out of battery and it has a couple of different settings. So one is the lowest, five is the highest. If you use it on one or two, you can do it like a free glide, like a fast motion, which I'll show you, which is what I normally do. It's really light this, so it's not too heavy and you're not gonna get um, like an arm ache. And then you just press it against your skin and flash it and move it up and it will continuously flash really really easy and it takes like 15 minutes to do the whole leg and it does not hurt at all guys if you're worried about the pain factor it's got like an active cooling technology in it which means that you're going to get a cooler and smoother result than any other kind of IPL on the market at home so I'm just going to do this a couple of times over this strand and then move on to the next so I'm just going to finish this on my legs and then I'm going to move up to my armpits and my bikini line as well. It's got a combination of different technology which means that you can use it on like different parts of your body which is great. You can use it on like your moustache if you want but you've got to be careful not to get it on your lips or anything. So yeah, I'm going to do this. Might put some Netflix on. Have a chill. <laughs> Have you guys ever used anything like this before? Like an at-home IPL device, let me know. I'm just doing some tidying and packing and I thought I'd show you two of the dresses that I'm gonna take with me. They are recently bought and I'm like obsessed with them both. I've been saving them for this little trip. This is the first, can you believe, it's from Primark. It was 13 pounds and it's like a long, I'd say like a semi maxi dress with a nice split down the middle really really pretty it has like a nice frilly detailing on the sleeves and a nice like low cut with a wrap around belt as well so yeah I picked this up earlier in the week and I'm really excited to wear it I feel like that um red dress dancing emoji when I um tried it on and then I picked this dress up from ASOS I think it needs a bit of an iron but it's from Glamorous and it's like a checked um, is this gingham? I'm not entirely sure, but it's like a checked short sleeved dress. The best thing about it is it has like this nice cut out back detail as well. So yeah, I'm really excited to wear both of these. Um, I'm just packing everything into these packing cases. I got these from Amazon and I'm just trying to, like I did some of this earlier in the week. So I'm trying to decide if I still, like I'm going for like three days. So I definitely don't need all these clothes. So I'm going to go through and streamline this a bit more. And I'm just taking my little suitcase with me. I got sent this. Came in the post today, one sec. This came from Lush. So they've done a collaboration with um, an illustrator, like a botanical illustrator called Charlotte Day. And I hadn't seen any of her work before, but how beautiful is that? Really, really pretty. It looks like she's got like a very unique um, style. So they sent some um, products from their collaboration. Ocean Salt, which is a face and body scrub. I've never used any of these products before. We've got Dream Cream, it's apparently great for eczema, so I'm really excited to try this. And then we also have the Mask of Mag Magnaminty. <laughs> I can't say it. I also just love the tote bag. What a beautiful collaboration, very summery and floral. This is probably the carbiest lunch I could choose to have, especially before a beach holiday, but I don't really care. Spinach and ricotta ravioli from Marks and Spencer's. Garlic bread and we've got some like tomato mascarpone sauce. I've just remembered that I have a Forever 21 delivery waiting at the um, UPS point. So I'm going to go pick that up now and take some returns back to the post office. I might also grab like um, I might go to Costa and get like a cold wrapper. Done all my errands and now I'm going to meet a friend for some drinks. He is in a band and the band are playing a secret gig tonight in my little area of London, Leightonstone. So I don't know if I'm going to stay that long because I have got an early morning and I've got a lot of packing left to do. But I'll take my vlogging camera anyway. Just thought I'd quickly show you what I'm wearing today. This top which is from Forever 21 and a little light lacy bra underneath. I think that's from Primark, I'm not sure. I've had these shorts for so long. I think they're from Boohoo, but for like a couple of years old. But I love them because they've got pockets and they're perfect for summer. And then I'm just wearing my Boohoo boots. Doesn't really like go too much, but I don't care. I need a bit of height. And then I've also got my blue little Topshop bag, which I quite like. <laughs> Oh, 
Look at this. I'm already finished packing. Had a late one last night, if you couldn't tell. Um, so I feel a little bit rough this morning. A little bit rough this morning, but I'm really looking forward to going away. Curled my hair, but I'm gonna have to wear it up now because it's raining. But yeah, I think I'm ready to go. Hope I haven't forgotten anything. So it was brilliant not having to worry about shaving my legs this morning. It's one of the pros. I met with my friend Sophie, and we are just having a breakfast beans breakfast. Seco and vegetarian breakfast, and I'm so off this. Chin. <laughs> we have arrived in Barcelona and we have a mini bus all to ourselves. We're only little, we've got a massive bus look. We've got a table each. We're just going to our hotel now to drop our bags off and freshen up and then we're gonna Maybe grab some food and explore. We're really looking forward to. What are we looking forward to? Sangria. We have just got to the hotel. I thought I'd do a quick um, room tour because it's really nice in here. So this is the room and it has this beautiful pink like curtain down it. Surrounded by trees by the looks of it. Massive bed. Bed is seriously massive. <laughs> Reminds me of a sci-fi film. What is that film? Oh, I think it reminds me of the film The Lobster. <laughs> it's funny. And then this is the bathroom. I'm just going to get changed and freshen up and then we're going to go and explore. It's like girls at the club where they dance around their handbags. <laughs> we have just come to a little outside the restaurant and we've got our first sangria, which we've been looking forward to all day. All day. Cheers. Chin chin. to one of my best friends properly it's me Sophie. we've been best friends for nearly 10 years now yes and we were just saying how weird it would be to think 10 years ago that we were here today in Barcelona and can you believe this is the first holiday she's ever taken me on <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. she's great Instagram and take her so this will be happening more watch frequently space. watch, watch this video space mm. I should be taking this right now <laughs> <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> had a really lovely day out but now it's time to go to bed but I will see you tomorrow for a full day exploring Barcelona I'm really excited morning so today is our first full day in Barcelona and we are heading out now we're gonna take a taxi to town and have some like brunchy breakfast hopefully some um what's it called tapas hopefully some tapas I'm really excited I'll show you what I'm wearing quickly so it's this dress and Sophie's just put some cream on my back because the back's quite open yeah it's really pretty taking some vlog pictures already this morning you of me using this I used it for the last time um on this trip and yeah all ready to go I must say it is a delight to have to not worry about shaving when I leave the house. We found a really pretty uh, vegetarian restaurant for breakfast and we've ordered like a mega deal. So we've got orange juice, fruit, and then we're getting some kind of like scrambled egg and spinach concoction. But it's really pretty in here. So brick walls, safety, babe. Got some fruit to start. Yum, yum. I've got a frozen margarita which is like a slush puppy and you've got pina colada. Just got back to the hotel and um, we went to the beach for hours and it was really nice. It was quite cloudy at first but then the sun came out and I think we were there for like four hours. It was a long time but really nice to kind of just chill and soak up the sun. Then we went for a drink. Then we went to take some blog pictures for the blog post I'm writing to go with this post. I will leave a link to it down below just in case you want to check that out. We've just come back to the hotel now. I'm going to have a shower. I feel really like 
dirty from the sand. Also, I cut my foot. <laughs> I went in the sea and I cut my foot on a rock, so I need to clean that a little bit. It's not hurting anymore now, which is good. I'm gonna do a little bit of work. I'm gonna do some editing, um, edit some of the pictures we took, and then I am going to go to dinner later. Sophie's friends are also in Barcelona at the moment, so we met up for them for drinks last night. We went to the Soho house, like Barcelona Soho house. And we're probably going to see them again tonight for dinner, and I'm really, really hoping for some tapas and some paella, because I haven't had any yet. Let's jump in the shower. I'm wearing this dress. I love it. It's so beautiful. I don't want to take it off. Um, I'm going to wear it to dinner tonight as well, because I feel very saucy with the side split eating the most amazing donut i've ever had in my life if anyone comes to barcelona you have to go to this place google it it is honestly the best donut i've ever had ever eating it in bed we have come to see sophie's friends again i'd like to introduce you to Hi. Armin and erin and i'm going to show you something super spectacular right now okay. are you guys oh, ready yeah. they've been come practicing on, this for hours <laughs> are you ready <laughs> next top model the pressure is on Work it, baby. Sparkle. No, your angles. Oh, yeah, there we go. There you go. <laughs> love them. Send them love and hearts. I am now back where I started in London. I had a really lovely break. Got back this morning, exhausted, and have a lot of work and packing to do. So, I am going to say goodbye now. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video. Do check out the description box and the blog post I wrote to go along with um, the holiday. Also, be sure to subscribe and I will see you again very, very soon. Bye, guys.